All right, starting this morning, Kirby High School is, uh, they've got their new classrooms, their kids back in new classrooms this morning. Jeanne Francine is monitoring that for us. It's taken a lot of preparation to get them back to school, Jeanne. That's right, Caitlin. Kirby Middle is one of the temporary locations for Kirby High School students this morning. I'm told 11th and 12th graders will be at this location, while 9th and 10th graders will be at Du Bois Middle School. For those special education students, those students will be at Southwind High School. While these schools being in different areas, transportation will be provided to all students who need it. This relocation has been a long time coming after several issues at Kirby High with rats, snakes, and roaches. The district tried to rid the school of the wildlife issue, but couldn't seem to get it fixed, causing the school to continuously close. Students from Kirby High have been keeping up with assignments with teachers online, but they still have work to make up from the first few days missed. We're going to do a number of things to, to get the students caught up. You know, we'll, we'll have uh, some tutoring on Saturdays and, of course, extending of our day uh, after school. But again, the technology is going to allow us to reach them outside of school hours. SCS tells us it could take the rest of the semester before Kirby High School officially reopens. No word yet on if they will have scheduled makeup days. Reporting live in Hickory Hill, Jean A. Francine, Day Memphis.